Jose also, I'm going lead the Boeing Applied Innovation Team. Uh, you are part of the uh, Vista section at the Dubai Air Show. It's very easy to get lost here. This is a hundreds of thousands of team uh, operation, but we are in one small corner representing the startup ecosystem and very proud to be here as one of the prime sponsors of the uh, Vista Air Show. Uh, our mission is to bring outside innovation into Boeing. And really, we are doing that by focusing on startups, startup investments. We're working with the greatest and latest entrepreneurs and the tech disruptors that are uh, here with us. Um, we have two hats on. One hat, we are presenting and showcasing our portfolio. And the other one is showcasing uh, or learning and meeting new startups. So we're going to show you guys today a, a few of our investments that we have uh, brought here to the air show. These are companies that have gone through a very rigorous due diligence process uh, and received an investment from the Boeing company. Uh, once they have received that status, that means that they have become a portfolio company. Uh, we are partial equity owners and uh, we work very hard to uh, bring their technology into the Boeing company, Boeing company's product lines, services, and everything that we can do to augment and enhance our, our services and products. Um, that's our first hat here. and We're gonna be you know, pr proudly presenting those uh, portfolios we brought with us. The next hat is we are trying to be a mentor. Uh, we're trying to really work with the startups that are here, help them mature. We just had an investor uh, workshop uh, talking about how to build a better pitch deck, how to pitch to uh, an investor, um, and what our focus areas are. So that if you are a startup that wants to work with Boeing, you have a better idea of how to do that. So, you know, on one hand, we're applauding the larger air show and trying to make sure that everyone knows what we're doing. On the other hand, we're trying to be a uh, better uh, supporter and mentor of the uh, newcomers that are presenting for the first time at this air show with us. Hi, I'm Hayden Shea. I'm the senior manager of portfolio development at the Boeing Company. We bring outside in innovation into Boeing through startup companies. Here at Vista, we're really fortunate to have four portfolio companies with us. The first is Neuroth Autonomy, which is enabling drones to fly autonomously in GPS denied environments. We also have Matternet, which is a new cargo delivery company, which is just recently launched one of the world's largest car, uh, drone delivery networks in Abu Dhabi. We have Fordham Technologies, which is providing airspace security with innovative radar designs and counter UAS solutions. And then lastly, we have InFly, which here this week at the show is launching their latest in-flight revenue products for airlines. My name is Jimmy Korf. Um, I'm the co-founder and chairman of Imfly, which is a company founded in 2013 in Barcelona. We help airlines to develop a mobile world in the aircraft so they can, uh, passengers can from their personal devices start um, watching movies, buying e-commerce products, a, a whole shopping experience from their personal devices so they can um, there is no um, touch uh, for example they don't need to um, everything is digitalized no uh, personal like magazines or the trolley from the passengers doesn't need from the cabin crew doesn't need to come and so everything can done automatically with the personal devices what we can see is that passengers with their own ipad uh, could buy from their seat um, food and beverage and we c they can do it from their personal device but also um, we, we offer the whole retail solution so cabin crew can just do the, the, per the payment with the um, payment device as you can see here in both devices. My name is Sanjeev Singh, I'm the CEO of Near Earth Autonomy. What we do is we develop technology to enable autonomous aircraft to fly safely and efficiently. We do that by using information that is known before the flight it started and also sensor data that is obtained during the flight in real time to keep the vehicle safe, to deal with one in a thousand or one in a million kinds of events that happen uh, to take care of the aircraft when something is in the way that's not mapped, there are other aircraft in the vicinity, GPS is degraded uh, when the aircraft has to, for example, land in, a, uh, in an emergency. So there are a number of these kinds of cases that have to be done to prove the, uh, that an autonomous air vehicle is completely safe, then it's operating in uh, a civilian airspace. 
So we provide that kind of technology. We add it to uh, rotorcraft or the fixed wing aircraft and make these vehicles safe and efficient. So we uh, started working with Boeing uh, many years before we were got an investment. I had been working on a project basis with them for a long time. Uh, when we had a major program that took a full-scale helicopter and showed how it could be flown autonomously, Boeing approached us. And since then, we've been doing a number of projects. Boeing invested in our startup, and uh, that has opened up many doors and given us access to uh, many use cases that are within the Boeing uh, company. So it's also been a very big credential for us that uh, Boeing has invested in us and has uh, uh, let us, given us some resources to productize our technology. So Matternet is a drone delivery company. We are focused on healthcare. We are a distributed peer-to-peer -peer node network, not a hub and spoke. What that essentially means is, is that we establish networks or nodes or locations at different sites and any of those sites or locations are able to deliver a package to any other site. And as the network grows, the value to all parties grow. And uh, again, we're focused on healthcare. We are operating today in uh, several markets, including Switzerland, the US, Germany, and we also have made an announcement uh, that we are going to be launching in uh, the UAE in the coming months. In Abu Dhabi, uh, I can refer you to a press release that was issued by the Department of Health two months ago that essentially announced that Matternet, together with our partner Skygo, will be launching a citywide drone network in the city of Abu Dhabi. And uh, as, uh, as I mentioned, uh, we are focused on healthcare applications. So we will be delivering packages between uh, various types of healthcare facilities. And uh, we will be building off of that um, into the future. Hi, my name is Timothy Bean. I'm the CEO of Fordham Technologies. We detect and defeat dangerous drones. Drones are becoming a real problem. They're the tool of choice of terrorists and criminals. And how do you keep stadiums safe? How do you keep your oil fields safe? Uh, concerts, venues, outdoor gatherings. Uh, Fordham has a solution that scales from small venues and stadiums to campuses and oil fields to entire cities and metro regions. And I'm pleased to talk to you today about that solution. Our company was founded in 2016. We got our start working with DARPA and the U.S. military. We sold millions of our systems to the U.S. Uh, military over the years. In 2018, we met Boeing, became acquainted with them. They spent over 50 people eight months doing a due diligence in our company and became investors. And our partnership with Boeing has been terrific by improving our technology, giving us resources for testing, et cetera, to make the system as best as it can be. And we continue to have a partnership with Boeing that's, that's uh, ongoing and bringing technology and capability and resources and customers to uh, spread our software and our hardware system across the world. You know, our system protects people. It's a defensive system against dangerous drones. And we're pleased to partner with Boeing and, and uh, our other investors in making that happen across the world.